Greetings and salutations, folks. I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here one trailer at a time. Beautiful fall day here in Aurelia, Ontario. We're going to take a fresh look at a 2023 Grand Design Imagine model number 3100RD. But from the second half of 2023, we got the new furniture, new countertops, new hardware with an on demand water heater. This guy weighs around 7,800 pounds or so. This is about as slick as skipping all of high school and still rolling in and passing your grade 12 equivalency test. I'm here with my friend, that Dutch bad boy, Brendan Hannemeyer, on the camera today. Say hello, Brendan. How's it going, happy campers? Thank you so much for tuning in to the number one RV YouTube channel in the world. Grand Design has brought us a little bit lighter of an interior just because of the countertops and stuff like that. Feels nice throughout here. I think you guys are really gonna enjoy this, but with darker handles, some sweet things coming on inside this thing. We got a like button, we got a subscribe button. Please subscribe, we've blown past 5,000. Let's keep going to 10. We're on Instagram, we're on TikTok, and we're on Facebook. Comment section's open. Let us know what you think about this. Your high school career is about as decorated as mine, wasn't it, Brennan? Yes, yes. very much so. Except I was student council president. <laughs> Were you really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I would have made fun of you. <laughs> Front power jack, 20 pound propane tanks, battery in a box location right through there. Great looking front fiberglass cap. That cap is painted, so it's gonna look hot for years to come. Nice eyebrow lights built in there. Then we got our pass through storage right through there to the other side. It's tall in through here, 47 cubic feet of pass through storage. That's because the frame is dropped down to allow for that. We've got our outside shower location, city water connection, solar display right through here, battery disconnect, outside receptacle. And if you're wondering what this little droopy hose is for, that's actually for uh, putting into the jung of antifreeze, turning your pump on, pumping the antifreeze through there. We've got motion sense of lights on both sides. There's your fresh water fill, and then we got four stabilizer jacks that are manual in each corner. We got our black water flush kit, furnace vent, outside light through here, and then your sewer drain is down here. There's your on-demand water heater right here. It's run by gas. It's uh, through Furion, which is a great company. Brandon, did you like how I touched on this last time? I did time? really like that. So <clears throat> usually with the furnace vent, you just get this little guy right here. So you have to service the furnace from the inside, which is a pain in the butt for technicians to do. This is a larger furnace vent, so you can actually undo it here, pull the whole furnace out, service it without getting into too much cabinet work. I really, really like that. That's an FF. What's that mean? A fun fact. A fun fact, eh? <laughs> Let me get a deep squat here. We got a 15 inch Goodyear tires, aluminum rims in through there as well. And we got no fridge vent, Brandon, why is that? Because we got the 12 volt fridge going. Check out all the windows we got on this guy. Window on the off door side, window on the back side, back side. Full size spare tire, 50 amp service, the roof ladder. Get up on your roof and check your seals every 90 days. There's also an outside spray port there at the back to spray things down, not hot and cold, just spray like cold water. And then check out all the door side windows here facing your campsite. We got LED lights in this massive awning, outside speakers, secure step right to the ground, lend a hand grab handle, outside receptacle, outside TV location in through here, and then this little circle here, Brendan, that's filled with mud. What do you think that's for? That's to manually bring out that far slide. Far slide, and you can also do the other side as well. Both slides on this guy, you can bring in manually if you ever need to. And then right here, we got the other side of our pass through storage. You kind of skip by the fact that it's got slam latch doors. That's a big bonus. And check how nice and thick these doors are. Well insulated, but not gonna warp on you. Close them down like that. Let's have a look inside, folks. Right on, folks. We're inside that 3100RD. You've just walked in the main door there. You've got great travel access to the washroom. You still have access here to the fridge on the side of the road. But looking back here into our living space, we've got three couches. Two of these couches are pull-out style trifolds. So you're going to actually sleep four people here at the back. Um, two on each couch kind of thing, as long as they're in love. We got windows all the way around here, so it doesn't really matter where you park this thing, you're gonna have a great view. And then here at the back, we've got our TV across from our feeder seats, that's awesome. Fireplace put on some good electric heat there down below. Uh, glass, I guess, covering in through here, hiding your radio, it's controls in through there, that's slick. And then we got storage here on either side. And then this is a good look at the new hardware. It's, you know, it's obviously pretty robust, nice flat black finish on it. And then up and through here, they've got rid of the silver that was in here. Now it's like a black uh, flat block as well, looking a little more subtle and uh, really, really nice storage across the top here. And then more storage down below. Looking forward into the rest of the trailer, we got our theater seats. We got heat, massage, and lights in through here. You can store your remotes in there. And you got cup holders on either side of you, which is cool. 
Uh, let's check out this pantry and kitchen space, AB. People love pantries. People love pantries. We do have a motion sense of light in here that I asked you to turn on, Brandon. It's not on. No charge. No charge. Do that for free. Storage here. Microwave range hood. Nice little kitchen window just to vent some stuff outside. You've also got a range hood, glass stove top cover with three burners underneath it. Oven with a light in it, and then a big pot and pan drawer right through here with those pegs in it. You can actually kind of organize how you're going to place your pots and your pans, that kind of thing. Large drawers here in the kitchen. Huge, huge drawers in through here. Um, we've got ourselves our 10 cubic foot 12 volt fridge. There is a 165 watt solar panel on the roof of this guy, charging your battery through your charge controller, and then your battery operating your fridge while you're dry camping. Or just doing things in general. Excuse me, Cornell. <clears throat> Can't get a moment's peace around here, eh? <laughs> All this cover space in through here, shelf through there, counter space on either side, stainless steel sink uh, that's under mount, which is cool, with this awesome little drying rack here you can dry your dishes on. And then this faucet does pull out, so you can kind of. I don't know, however you do dishes in through there. It's a big deal, dude. I got one of those in my new house. Now you can clean every part of the sink. Listen, we get it, you're rich. You got a house. Got we got a nice little place. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now, thanks for the 5,000 subscribers, everyone. Yeah, I made the difference, right? There. <laughs> yeah, the monetization on that is Unreal. ridiculous. <laughs> Notice we're not monetized, folks. No, we and, are not. Anyways. We do this for free. <laughs> we do this for We're lives. charity. <laughs> <laughs> Freestand table and chairs. Now, that looks pretty standard, pretty easy to use, but this has got an extra little feature here. You pull down this knob, pull this table out, actually rotate this around, and then slide this back in. We have a desk. And we have a desk, or if it's just the two of you, right, and you want a little more space here in the kitchen, that's pretty fantastic to be able to kind of do that how you want. And then that window right through there is awesome. And then we have the roller shades blocking out of that light if you need to do that. And really nice and easy to use. Look how big that blind is. Unreal big window. That's awesome in through there. Uh, coming through here, Brendan, we've got our Compass Connect system where we got our switches for our slides, our awning, our lights, our monitor panel, that kind of thing. Uh, thermostat right through here, and then also a thermostat for our on-demand water heater. That's one of the benefits to an on-demand water heater is you can actually control the temperature. So if there's kids in here, you don't think it's too hot, you can actually dial that down, which is cool. Porcelain style toilet here. <clears throat> the dump truck fits, like there's great hip space in through here. We got some nice shelving in beside the shower. They covered there. It's kind of blocked off. And we got three drawers in through here. I like how these drawer guides or these drawer handles are on the top of the so door. Big. Yeah, nice and easy to get in there. <clears throat> Storage on both sides for the medicine cabinet. I think there's a cover right behind me. Yeah, look at that. And through there, towel bar too right there. And then up into the shower. I'm six feet. I fit here really, really easily. Nautilus style door, bringing it across. There's actually a built-in squeegee there. It's gonna wipe off the water. Nice black fixtures there. Coming out into the bedroom here, Brendan. These guys do the bedrooms the best. There's nobody who does them this good. We got hanging storage, double drawers, cubbies on either side, receptacles, USBs, nice reading lights. You can actually adjust those down to this nice little blue soft light there for nighttime storage across the top and that still is not including all this storage we got in through here with another motion sense of light i asked you to turn on and then a large drawer in through here another one right there and then still storage here underneath the bed look at that in there we got that tray that's going to slide across give you some nice flexibility with your storage options that's the video folks hit the like button subscribe button hit us up on instagram facebook tiktok leave us a comment down below and have yourself a good day